There once was a man with a stash. He ran around looking for cash. He got to the zone, and then he was boned. I'm sorry, but Warzone is trash. Hey guys, James here with another game review, this time talking about Call of Duty Warzone. Although, this is less of a game review and more of a rant on why I think Warzone, quite frankly, just isn't that fun. Usually I would compare the game to other games, but this is COD and a battle royale, so it's kinda what you expect, honestly. Now before I get started, I do want to say I really did want to like this game, but I feel like I've given this game so many chances and I've uninstalled and reinstalled the game so many times, which given the game's massive file size, has been quite painful. And to be fair, I do like Call of Duty Modern Warfare overall, having played a decent amount of multiplayer and campaign, although I do think the game has quite a few flaws, particularly from a technical side. But I can't help but feel like Warzone is just not fun, and quite frankly, it perplexes me how popular it is on Twitch, which I think is simply due to it being COD and a free game. But I'll be fair, they do do some things pretty well. At a high level, being a Call of Duty game, the game does feel well made enough. It has good graphics, and the gunplay feels pretty good, but it's far from perfect, especially since there seems to be a lot of technical issues and glitches. I actually like how they incorporated the different objectives you can get through the game, as it gives you something to do in this walking simulator. I actually like the vehicles as well, other than the helicopter. I also like that it allows you to group at all levels, from solo to a full 4 squad, so you don't have to deal with any randos running around the map on their own. And while a lot of people seem to complain about crossplay from both PC and controller sides, I actually like it because it allows me and my friends to play together. The aim assist in COD is actually really strong too, so I don't think one necessarily has a huge advantage over the other. But alright, on to the bad. And for this video, I won't even dive into the issues like the rampant hackers, the huge game size and updates, the terrible servers, and of course the common issues with all battle royales. You know, like dropping and getting killed immediately, or hell, even dying while you're parachuting down, RNG with weapon spawns, and dying because your building just didn't happen to have a good gun. The fact that it's a walking simulator with some shooting sprinkled in. And the fact that you're constantly getting third partied. So here are my real problems with Warzone and why I think it's a fundamentally bad game. It's just so slow. Being able to be respawned and bought back so many times makes it so games take way too long. Having 150 players isn't necessarily a problem, but having 150 players who can potentially come back from the gulag and then again later with buyback mechanics makes the game feel way too long. To be clear, I do like being able to buy teammates back, as no one wants to just sit around and watch their friends play, but I think it should be limited in some way. The slowness of the game is also further amplified by the huge map, as well as the fact that there are just so many campers. There's campers everywhere. I just don't understand how people have fun literally just claiming a roof, watching buy stations, or sitting in buildings waiting for people to come by. The amount of times I've been pinned down in an area because of someone on a roof waiting for me is stupid. Being able to helicopter around and land on roofs is stupid. The map being so big and having so much verticality with the buildings also makes it so camping is rewarded, and it can feel impossible to push on people without getting exposed against snipers and third parties. I also think that the weapon balance is pretty bad, so the time to kill can be really inconsistent as a result. You can empty a full clip into someone and they won't die, but one or two sniper shots kills an enemy, and it's not like it's particularly difficult to snipe in this game either. This issue is compounded by the fact that it can be quite easy for someone to run and hide, then heal up naturally, and since the time to put in armor plates is so fast, it forces you to have to redo all that damage all over again. At least in other battle royale games, there's a decent amount of time it takes to heal or use an armor pack, but that is completely negated in this game. In all the games I've played, I just struggle to find enjoyment from it. Half the time you're doing nothing, and the other half you're just getting sniped at. As dumb as it sounds, the gulag is in my opinion the best part of Warzone, because at least it's guaranteed action, and at that point, I'd rather just play gunpoint or normal multiplayer. Or hell, even the plunder mode is more interesting in my opinion. I think at its core, Warzone just rewards campy play, which makes the game not fun for me. In my opinion, it's the worst of the big battle royales, those being Fortnite, Apex, and PUBG. In my personal opinion, I think they need to change the map. Reduce the amount of buildings on the map, 
cut down the number of skyscrapers and rooftops and other big-ass buildings you can just camp on. Not only that, they should make it harder to snipe or improve other weapons in order to balance them out a little bit. Finally, I think they should scale buybacks to make it cost more money to bring people back additional times, or just completely change the mechanic. Call me crazy, but dying should feel pretty impactful in a battle royale. Otherwise, it's really just a boring version of ground war. But hey, that's just me. If you agree or disagree with the points I made, feel free to let me know in the comments, I'm more than happy to discuss. And if you made it this far, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, please consider hitting the like button, and maybe even subscribing to my channel. I try to do game reviews and discuss gaming related topics, and I love discussing different topics with my viewers. Once again, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Peace.